physical attraction. Have you ever seen someone so beautiful, so pleasing to the eyes that your brain just stopped working? Literally quit on you. Shut down, system crash. I mean, other than me, naturally, my eyes are up here, ladies. But someone so beautiful there was just a complete disconnect between your logical mind and your voice box. You could not form any thoughtfully connected sentences. Hi, how are you? Yeah, the cold Wednesday sure likes periwinkle corner loafers. What? Or you couldn't even put words together. Or have control of your facial muscles. It's just gibberish. I really like your beard. How the with Bob with the ham ham or maybe you take the most fire selfie of your life and post on social media and someone definitely falls for your thirst trap. I mean, not that I would ever do something like that. Why do I bring it up? Because in, oh, I don't know, the entire history of human existence, appearance is valued as a pinnacle achievement or supremely motivating factor for a lot of decisions. I'm not going to decry the pursuit of looking good, feeling good, being healthy, etc. These are not inherently evil or bad things by any means. And when it comes to romantic relationships, there has to be some level of physical attraction to light that spark for a lot of people out there. But there's a reason it's called physical attraction and not physical retention. Attention. Physical attraction is important. It is. But it's fully subjective and constantly evolving. Life experiences, both positive and negative, and cultural trends will change what you do and don't find physically attractive about a potential partner. And typical, but not overriding, gender differences may ascribe varying levels of importance to physical appearance. But physical attraction is not foundational. You cannot build a life solely on physical attraction. If you are with someone purely for how they arouse your visual sense, you need to ask yourself this very serious question. When do I plan on ending the relationship? A month? Six months? A year? 10 years? Because it has a guaranteed expiration date. How can you say that? Look at how hot they are. Because the shiny is bound to wear off. You don't understand. I have never been attracted to someone like this before. <laughs> Eventually those feelings, endorphins, and emotional highs will wear off and you will be left with nothing of substance to retain the relationship. Are you calling me shallow? You're acting shallow. I'm just calling it how I see it. So judgmental. <laughs> okay, pumpkin. Live your life however you see fit. Understand this. Play adult games win adult prizes. If you are on the prowl purely for the best looking, best feeling, highest hormonal arousing carbon-based package on the market, enjoy that. By all means, please do. But you have a moral obligation to be upfront about that. Yes, a moral obligation. Because if you are with someone who is in love with who you are, and you only love the way they look, or heaven forbid just passing time to avoid being alone, that is a grossly mismatched pairing. Let them go so the right person can love the entirety of who they are, not just the pretty and convenient parts. And you can enjoy a revolving door of meaningless flings and emotionally degenerative relational couplings that do absolutely nothing for your soul development, emotional maturity, intellectual growth, or the world around you. Just don't complain to me or anyone else when you wake up alone one day with absolutely nothing or no one to show for it. <laughs> yeah. Truth can be rough. Because life is not a race to the bottom, it is a climb to the top. I am Tim, and I have no chill. Let nobody tell you how to live, how to be. I told negativity, you gotta get up out of me. Here's a quote about life, like the word is my rock. It's not a race to the bottom, it's a climb to the top, yeah. Some people like to poke and prod trying to find out what my type is when it comes to women. I don't normally speak on this, but for one time and one time only, I'm going to tell you that what I absolutely look for physically in the opposite sex is... <laughs>